All right, let's get going. Everything's nice and dry. And I was able to find my pencil. And I was able to find quite a few things looking for my pencil. I mean, my pins. What am I talking about? Some. I don't know if you guys know. I didn't know for quite a while. <laughs> till I figured it out. That these pins, when they come new, these Signo Uniball Bold 207. There's a little blue thing there. Can you guys see that? I'm going to move it around just in case you can't see. It's supposed to pop that off. Yeah, you see that? I was like, my pin don't work. My pin did don't work. Anyways, not sure if this pin's gonna do what I want it to do. Like I mentioned, I tried it on uh, paper and it worked obviously, but I'm not sure about the wood. But let's try. That's working. And in order to keep it from smearing, what I'll do is spray it with, oh, one of my. Let's see if I can find it. With this stuff. Sealer. The Americana Sealer. Okay. Let's, let's do this. Let's get all that blue stuff off. It's not all the way off. Okay. Let's do this. Let's go in here. It's working quite well. I'm enjoying it. Okay, and then we're going to double it up. Just like that. Perfect. Then I'll get black ink, black something, something. I don't know if I want to use this completely in there. Let's see. I don't know. We'll see if I continue with that. Let's just do it like that for right now. I don't want to do too much because in reality I, I might smear it. Let's let that dry. But what I want to do is come in here and just go like this. Some little, little, little feathers in here, here and there. Definitely some here. Here on this other side. And I'll continue to go through. And then what I also want to do is go in to these feathers like this and attach like that. Okay, I think I'm gonna turn. I'm gonna I'm gonna put these away so I have some more space. sure if I'm going to keep it turned. We'll find out. Not sure if I'm comfortable doing it that way. You guys need to be proud of me. 
I decided to come and do this instead of washing my dishes. Be proud of me. Let me zoom you guys in a little. Just like that. You see, I might smear that. I'm going to do my best to not smear it. Messed up on that one, but that's okay. It's a feather. As soon as I start loosening up and feeling and having the thoughts of, you can do this, let go, let go, let go of your thoughts of, you can't do this or it's looking messy. As soon as I let go and start thinking, I can do this, that's when the magic starts to happen. I'm getting there. Listen up. Loosen up, loosen up. I can do this. This is my personal art. This is just me playing and sharing and showing that we can all do this. There we go, secret. Good job. Oh yeah. See, as soon as I said it and put it out there, now I'm feeling it. I'm feeling the I can. Love it. Enjoy yourself. Never doubt yourself. Just like you would never doubt your child, you always encourage your children. And if you don't have kids, you encourage your animals. You encourage your thoughts. As far as in here, I think I will go ahead and use this up in here. I'll be honest and share with you why I didn't want to use the pin in the middle because I know if I run out, I'm not going to be able to replace this pin for a while. So I'm kind of thinking of being frugal with it. But my thoughts right now, since I freed myself and allowing myself to be free, 
and be positive. I'm thinking to myself, just do it. Use it. Love using your art supplies, right? And if you waste it, it'll come to you. That's a, why we have art supplies, right? To use it up. I could probably grab some acrylic and do it. That's a definite. I mean, that's your choice. If you'd like to do that, go for it. Have fun. Use up your stuff. Have fun. Have fun. Then I'll come in and highlight a little bit with some white. Now, some white polka dots in there would be amazing. <clears throat> I'm wondering if the jelly roll will work in here. Yeah, sure is. Maybe I need to let that dry a little bit more. Maybe I'll put a little heart. Oh, I like that. Oh, that is sweet. I'm very proud of myself. I really, really like this. You know, the m most... Um, fulfilling part about it is that I've taught myself with the encouragement of you guys. Thank you so very much for all of my old subbies. I, sm I smile, I giggle a little because you guys are special to me. Very special to me. And all for all my new subbies, you guys are special too like to get to know you. If you like, leave me a comment. I always, always reply back to my comments. Yeah, that needs to dry some more. 
I'm kind of thinking, what if, let me put the fan towards me first. I hope that you don't get too much of the fan noise, but this girl is hot. I'm wondering if, how would it look if I were to shade some of these in with white? Let's see. Let me come shade this small one in. Okay, it's not wanting to work. I hope I'm not running out. Okay, it's working again. Alright, I like that. Let's, let's just fade in, shade in some of these. Yep. I could definitely use acrylics to do this also. And you're more than welcome to use acrylics if you don't have a gel pen. But I thought to myself, since I did start with inks, I'd like to call it a whole inked feather. And being that the jelly pen is an ink, it's nice to think it's all done in ink and the background in acrylics. I think I'm going to rugged out the edges. And I'm definitely going to put dots on this side also. You guys see what I'm doing? Some seem not to be as white because the ink is not completely dry. I really like it. Hope you guys enjoy. I really, really hope you guys have been inspired by all of us collaborating in this hashtag event. Maybe some dots in here. Still not dry enough. That's okay. I want to balance it out. Kind of tempted to shade in the heart completely. Not sure yet. But it won't hurt to do one, right? It doesn't mean I have to do all of them. You know, feathers hold a very, very special part in my heart. If they bring comfort, they bring joy. I like that. Still not dry enough. I'm trying though. Mm, right here.
thinking, what if I put little swirls coming down? That's cute. On certain ones, like this right here. And maybe one up here. Don't want to make it too busy. Let's put a heart over here. Should I go all the way through with the white, or do we leave it like that? What if I go all the way through with black on some of them? Let's find out. Yeah, I like that too. Let's do that. Let's start up here so that I don't smear it. And I'm thinking also to put a black heart I'm wondering if jelly rolls come in different colors. I'd have to look into that. Then again, why look if I know I can't get it? It's kind of like teasing myself. So I'll look when I, when I have cash. I know they come in gold. I do have a gold one. It was sent in Happy Mail. I think that was sent by my um, my angel, Lori B. Which, till this day, I don't know who she is or he. Sounds like a she though. I'm wondering if she still watches my channel. Lori B, are you watching my channel still? You have not commented, you haven't told me who you are. For those that don't know who Lori B is, Lori B is a lady that has supported me with art supplies. And I don't know who she is. And she likes to play tricks. <laughs> and instead of putting her address, she doubles my address as it being her address. I think that's something. It's nice. It's really, really nice to have that happen in your life. It's a wonderful experience to think that somebody watches your channel and says to themselves, hey, I'm going to bless this girl, this woman, this art creator on YouTube, and I'm going to keep it private and not say who I am or where I come from, where I live, and send her a very, very happy package. I think she's done three boxes that she has sent me. <laughs> oh, and she sends me her art, which is beautiful art. I have some. Um, it's over there. And I know you guys are rushing to see the other artist. 
But don't feel rushed. Don't feel rushed to watch the other artists. Of course, go support them. Go find yourself some inspiration. But the, will, the videos will always be available to you, so don't feel rushed. They're not going to disappear. But Lori B. sends me her artwork and art supplies. And in the box of art supplies, she sends me a very beautiful feeling that I get when I open it. I feel loved. I feel appreciated. It's very, very nice. And she sends me happiness. Happiness in a box. The only thing I struggle with, not knowing who it is, is not knowing if she's still around, if she's okay, if she's healthy, if she's loved, if she gets support, because I would like to do that for her. I would actually love to Skype with you, Lori B, and art with you on Skype. So, Lori B, if you're watching and you'd like to accept my invitation to Skype with me and art while we're Skyping, I would love that. But. In order for me to know it's you, Lori B, send me a message saying that you accept my invitation. But send me a message telling me what it was that you put in the envelope in the last package. Only you and I know what was in there. So that's how I will know it's you. And I say that because I need to protect myself. And it would have to be exactly what you sent me in that one special envelope and why you sent it because I know you had a purpose and I know what that purpose was. Okay, so let's put some hearts. Um, some black hearts. Here and there. Not too many. And then a swirl. Well, let's just leave it. I, you know, let's just move on. Okay, I call this done. I'm going to sign it with my birth name. It is one of one. And today's date is... What is today's date, guys? I'm so lost. 9-18. And I call it done. I'm very proud of myself. I love it. How do you guys like it? Really, really love it. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope it inspired. Leave me thumbs up. And...
comments and support. I love you guys. Thanks for joining. And remember to hashtag, hashtag, love fall art. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.